So I don't know if you can see, but I'm pretty sure you can. That's the commissariat, the police. So before I tell you why I was actually at the police station, let me tell you what you've missed since the last time you were on my channel. First, my last six months in France have been the most challenging and life-changing six months I've ever been through. It began with when my visa actually expired in December. During this particular time when your visa expires in France, you're technically not allowed to work legally. So technically when my visa expired in December, I couldn't earn for the last six months. I couldn't, I couldn't go and find a legal job in the last six months, which also hindered my ability to make any money to sustain myself here in France. In February, I was asked to leave my apartment because I did not again have the money to stay in that particular apartment. But this is where I actually was very fortunate to have friends who allowed me to live currently in that particular apartment which is right there. In March, I actually thought, okay, I was about to get my visa and I thought it was finally about to end and that's when I actually figured out my school was not a recognized school nor was my degree a recognized school because the government asked my school to provide one of these two documents and they couldn't provide it to the government. Got my phone uh, company closed my phone account, my bank account threatened to close my bank account and just when I thought that I was almost at the finish line last week I lost my wallet and my wallet had my visa in it. It shook me up. I was so scared. I've never been this scared in my life. Like, I didn't know what to do. I thought it was game over and it was time to pack and go home. How did I not freak out? I actually had good friends who told me, okay, listen, you just need to go to the police station, submit your report, take that report, go to the prefecture. The prefecture will give you a duplicate card. All you need to do is just apply for a duplicate card. Do not freak out. It's okay. It's going to be fine. And eventually, it did become fine. In this particular process, I had a French friend whose husband actually went and asked all the stores in their community for a job for me and finally I have a, a part-time job today. It is not legal. Again, I was only able to survive the last six months because of the network and the resources or the access of information I had through my friends and network. And I know this, all these situations could happen to anyone. But the problem is I was freaking out because I did not have access to the right information or maybe at that particular time to the right person. And this can... And this actually, in my eyes, the perspective was game over. But my point being is, even though I had access to all of this, I know a lot of you, a lot of people, a lot of international students who come here do not have such access that I do. And it is for that simple reason that I don't want anyone else to go through the same. At least I went through the same and I had people, but there, there might be so many people who go through the same problems but don't have anyone to help them. And it is for that simple reason that I'm tired of seeing students who come here who, who actually get screwed either by the system just because they don't know the language or just by simple problems and just they couldn't find help or they couldn't find a network or they couldn't find any resources through their friends. And it is for that simple reason I've actually started the Indian Student Network of France. The only objective for the Indian Student Network of France is to actually provide you with as much as resources in terms of meeting people, in terms of events which help you grow, in terms of workshops, in terms of providing you with mentors, in terms of uh, you know a place where you can actually ask people for help when you need help. And I think that is the most important thing, I think that is the most important resource you need as an international student when you live in France. Uh, let me be the first one to welcome you to the Indian Student Network of France. First, you need to actually go and like our page on Facebook, join the squad. We're going to post our student-friendly content, like job offers, events, uh, you know, student discounts, whatever is actually attractive to me as a student, I'm going to post there. Two, I would recommend you to join our Indian Students in France group on Facebook where you can actually have conversations with other Indian students or other international students who plan on coming to France this year or the next year. Three, I also recommend you to join a meetup group on Meetup, which is also again under the same name, Indian Student Network of France. Under this group, we are actually going to host our first event next month on the 11th of July at Le Rotterdam Bar in Paris 11. The whole objective is to get all you wonderful internationals in one place so that we can meet each other, learn from each other and have a wonderful, awesome night.
I'm I'm very excited for this particular project because there's only one goal to help you integrate as quickly as possible into the French society. For if if you all still have further questions for me, please uh, feel free to DM me on my Instagram at the Lost Indian at the Lost Indian. For all of you who have messaged me and I take time, I'm, I really apologize for the delay. There's been so much on my plate, as you can see. I have a part-time job. I'm running around for my visa. I'm trying to survive. If you actually want to be a part of my WhatsApp group, please do DM me on Instagram, and I can actually give you the link to the WhatsApp group. If you actually more are worried about whether your school is RNCP certified or a Grand École, you can actually go to my blog www.englishjobsinfrance.com, where I've actually created a table compiling all the business schools, their rankings, whether they're Grand École or not all the accreditations and it's much easier I think now since all of that all that all, all of that information is compiled in one place just for you with that like this video and get this video to 150 likes and I should see you next time